A federal program designed to help hospitals at the beginning of the pandemic is on track to hurt them at the end of this week. We are anxious to hear within the next couple of days, I'm hopeful, that um, that this the, the terms of the program have been modified. MAP repayment begins August 1st. If hospitals can't afford it, the money will be taken from Medicare reimbursements until the loan is paid in full. The rural populations tend to be older, um, sicker. Kara Veal is the CEO of the Indiana Rural Health Association. She says Indiana's rural hospitals would likely face closure if they can't get Medicare dollars. At the least, an extension is is um, probably the number one ask. We've asked um, for for Congress also to consider forgiveness of the loans. Meanwhile, the Indiana Hospital Association is concerned about MAP's interest rate. The interest rate, I believe, will go up to uh, 10%, uh, which is you know, well above market rates. IHA says Medicare patients will still be treated. Hospitals just won't get paid, which would have a long-term impact. We may see some hospitals in Indiana um, not be able to continue certain services or, uh, you know, we hope uh, not, um, but may have to think about things including closures. Indiana U.S. Senator Todd Young's spokesperson says Senator Young shares concerns Indiana hospitals have expressed about the repayment deadlines. He is optimistic an extension will be included in the coronavirus relief legislation to be released this week. Kayla Sullivan, Fox 59 News. Now we're told an extension could be announced as early as tonight or tomorrow. What's still not clear is whether any other repayment terms will be modified.